great win for us on the weekend to start our season. Uh, our opponents for this weekend, Oldham, got a loss. So, you know, is, how what are your thoughts heading this one? Well, last week's results are rele relevant to this week's in, in that respect. Both teams have to restart the engines as we would have done on Monday, um, get through this week, and hopefully everybody's fit and able to be uh, selected from it, from my point of view. Um, and we'll travel up on Friday um, in good spirits. It's been a really good week. Um, the, the two lads that took knocks um, on Nichols on the weekend both seem okay. We're still here after training on Thursday, so we'll probably have a similar sort of squad to choose from um, as we did on match day one. Like I said, what they do is their business, but we, we'll be going up there in confident mode, but, but ultimately there's one game played and we know it's a, it's a very long season. You, you talked about good spirits there, obviously that was something we talked about a lot during the summer, you wanted to get the personalities in that gel. I know in the interviews I've done with some of the players in pre-season and even on Saturday Jack was saying that the, the group's gelling really well, it's, it's, so you must be delighted to see that. Yeah, I think all management and, and staff right through our league and everybody else's league, you know, the six week period you spend together is intense, it's hard work, but you do get to know each other a lot. You spend more time, you know, in that environment than you do in any other in that six week period. And, I think for us to get a really positive start and, and the way that the fans engage before, during and after the game is really encouraging. But like I said to the players this morning, if what they did last week seems big to them, then they haven't done anything this week yet. So, you know, Saturday is firmly in our uh, crosshairs and, and it's, it's only that that we're looking at. You know, we know we'll have a game three days after, but from the playing point of view, all we're focused on is all done. Well, they're looking, at, they're looking at those opponents, Oldham, obviously they did suffer a defeat in their first game, but you know we, we know they're a huge club and, and they're going to provide us with a big challenge, aren't they? Yeah, I mean, more than half the teams in the division will be, will be disappointed with the result that they had last week, so therefore just less than half will be pleased with it. So we're in that, we're in that majority at the moment, but we want to try and stay there. You know, it's a difficult time. Every, every team in this division gives you a different puzzle. You know, Oldham are a huge football club, let's not forget that. I played there in the top division in, in England a long, long time ago, and they won on the last day of the season to stay in, in that division. So their history is massive, they're, they're, it's a big club, and they'll be smart, and they won't, look, they won't be wanting to turn up and, and that happened to them again, again at all this season, never mind this week. So let's not forget, you know, there'll be a wounded animal and they'll come out roaring, and, and we, we've got to be mindful of that. Um, and when we get the opportunity to put our game on them, which undoubtedly, hopefully will happen, at some stage through the 90 minutes, then we've got to take the best of the, the opportunities that we get. Uh, I know it was a brilliant performance from all the team, but those front three were firing. Is that something that you've seen in training that it looks like it's going to carry on happening? Yeah, I mean, there's things we've worked on literally from the get-go, from coming back to pre-season with the new group. You see, the vast majority of the group have been with us, so certainly the ones that started the game. And I think it becomes, you know, the repetition work that we do is just that. It re it's repeat and repeat, I think. I've worked at all levels and the further down you go, you have to repeat what you want. Otherwise, they go, well, we never did that this week. So, you know, that's, that's something they've bought into. I think it's the skill sets we have, we're trying to implement as much as we can to the, the strengths, not the weaknesses. And some, sometimes coaches and managers ask and demand things of players that they simply can't do. And, and I don't do that, so or we don't do that. Um, and like I said, I'm not getting carried away. It was an excellent performance and result. Sometimes we'll have great performances and not get the result we want. Sometimes we'll get the result we want and not play particularly well. I'll take either. You know, so from that, from that um, viewpoint, we, like I said, we, we look forward. A long trip up, but um, and we're having the, the benefit of being able to stop on the way and train at a, an EFL training ground, which is really, really pleased about. Um, so yeah, we're really looking forward to it.